How you doing? I'm Callan and this is Slapped Ham. Today we're looking at some creepy videos you probably shouldn't watch at night time. But before we get started, hit that subscribe button for more creepy content, just like this. In some creepy videos, every detail conspires to paint a truly chilling picture. That is certainly the case with this footage shot on a phone camera in India. In the video, it appears that the person behind the lens decided to capture a video while riding a motorbike along a dark road. We can occasionally spot another rider passing by and bits of landscape, but the footage is largely dark. Suddenly, the bike's headlamp catches something bright and white reflecting in the dark. After a few seconds, the image comes into focus and we see a mysterious figure standing in the road. The figure appears just as a wolf begins to howl in the night. The ghostly figure wears a flowing white dress that billows in the breeze. It's too dark to see its face, but long dark hair spills over the front of the stark white dress. The figure doesn't seem to move as the filmer approaches. The video is mostly silent, only capturing the baying wolves and the filmer's panicked breaths. Towards the end of the footage, the filmer gets close enough to make out some blurry features on a pallid face. After that, the video abruptly ends, with no indication of what happened to the poor soul who came across this ghostly apparition. Closed circuit television cameras have long been a source of creepy videos. For example, take a look at this scary CCTV footage from a security camera in the Barnsley Antique Centre in South Yorkshire. The video depicts what appears to be a storage room in the back of an antique store. We can see various curios and knickknacks scattered throughout the room, but no people. The room is completely still. Then the glass door of a cabinet standing up against the wall of the room suddenly swings open and almost immediately shatters. The camera captures the shards of glass as they rain down to the floor. This particular antique store is no stranger to hauntings. Employees at the Barnsley Antique Centre have spotted numerous other examples of ghostly activities in footage from the store's CCTV cameras. It isn't unusual to see items falling and breaking when no one's around. One video even appears to capture a ghostly mist within the walls of the store. Some believe that the videos are a publicity stunt, but employees of the store insist that the hauntings are the real deal. CCTV strikes again, this time in a liquor store. Employees of this liquor store in Sydney, Australia came into work one morning to find a display of champagne bottles smashed on the floor. With no indication that the store had been broken into, they were puzzled. They decided to review the footage from the store's security cameras to find an answer to this perplexing mystery. They might have expected a rogue employee or even a rat tipping over the display. What they actually saw was much creepier. A few seconds into the video, we see a bottle on the second level of the display suddenly burst, its contents spraying all over the aisle. A little later, the top tiers of the display fall, smashing the bottles onto the floor. Skeptics have been quick to dismiss this video. They state that the pressure from the carbonated wine could have caused the bottle to explode spontaneously, and that the bottles that were knocked out of place could have unbalanced the display and sent it crashing to the ground. However, in the final seconds of the video, we can clearly see that the remaining boxes begin shaking due to an unknown force. So what could have caused these mysterious tremors? Let us know what you think in the comments section below. Just before Halloween in 2017, the owners of the Tyler's Kiln in Canterbury, Kent added their own CCTV footage to the collection of creepy videos on the internet. Unlike many of the other videos out there, this footage consists of a compilation of shots that were taken via motion alerts set up on the pub's security cameras. The alleged ghost in this footage gets up to quite a bit of mischief. 
We see chairs moving, doors swinging, objects falling. And even an umbrella opening, all without a culprit in sight. Many skeptics believe that the wind is responsible for the movements, which could explain some of the activity on the outdoor patio. However, there would be no wind inside the pub, and it's unlikely the wind could open a table umbrella. Current owner Alistair Collins has his own theory about the haunted happenings. He believes that a former owner named Gilbert, who passed away in 1978, is the likely culprit. Perhaps Gilbert wants to keep an eye on his beloved building. However, others believe that the whole thing was a Halloween publicity stunt, but employees still prefer to keep the lights on when alone in this pub. On July 26, 2014, a medium named Roy Roberts took to the stage of the Brookside Theatre in Romford, Essex. The performance proceeded as expected. The next morning, theatre manager Jay Seppel returned to the theatre and immediately noticed a chair that was out of place. He doesn't typically check the building's CCTV footage, but he was curious as to how the chair got moved. He was astonished by what he saw. In the footage, the chair clearly moves on its own. There were definitely no people in the theatre visible in the video. In addition, the table in the back of the room appears to get pulled slightly. Viewers have also pointed to possible orbs on the tape, but these could just be bits of dust floating through the air. When Roy Roberts was informed about the events, he stated that he felt a definite presence in the theatre during his performance. He didn't know at the time what caused his feelings, but now believes that the video indicates that it was a ghost. According to Roberts, this footage has earned its place among the internet's creepy videos. The TV series Ghost Hunters is known for visiting supposedly haunted locations in a quest to determine if the ghostly claims are fact or fiction. This spine-chilling video was featured on the show when the Ghost Hunters visited the Mitzbar Hotel in Nevada. The footage was taken on one of the hotel's security cameras. It depicts a dark room. If you watch closely in the bottom right-hand corner of the screen, be prepared to see something eerie. The dark shadow of a human-like figure appears to fly across the screen. The figure is dark and moves with supernatural speed, making it impossible to discern any details about it. Even when the video is enhanced to focus on the spot where it appears, it's nothing more than a fast-moving blur. The hotel's owners state that staff and guests regularly encounter the hotel's numerous resident ghosts. Although it can be creepy to work side by side with spirits, so far the encounters have all been friendly, if a bit unnerving. In 2011, the Holbrook family began experiencing bizarre and unfortunate events in their Coventry home. First, their dog, who seemed in perfect health, suddenly passed away with no explanation. As the family grieved for their pet, a family member took a tragic fall down the stairs. This incident was enough for the family to decide to set up a camera to try and capture evidence of what was going on. In this video, we can see several items that appear to move on their own. A wardrobe door opens. Then a chair slides across the floor. There are no people in the room who could have moved them. Then, the lights in the room suddenly turn off on their own. Many believe that the family orchestrated the video as a hoax, but others aren't so sure. Derek Akora, a noted medium, visited the home to investigate and to attempt to rid the house of its ghostly residents. According to Akora, the home is indeed at the mercy of a poltergeist. He states that a very angry spirit named Jim is responsible for the incidents in the video shot by the Holbrooks. Before we get to that number one spot and take a look at some terrifying footage of a peeping Tom caught crawling in his neighbor's attic, remember to hit that subscribe button and turn on channel notifications. 
That way you'll be updated about all our latest content. In 2017, not long after welcoming a new daughter to the world, Jerome Kennedy of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania started hearing strange noises coming from the attic, above he and his wife's bedroom. He investigated the attic and found unexplained drill holes and even a flashlight. He set up a secret camera to find out what was going on. What he discovered shows that reality can be scarier than the paranormal. In the footage, we see Kennedy's neighbor remove a false wall that the neighbor had put between their two attics. According to Kennedy, the man had removed all of the insulation in the floor so he could gain access to the vent and peer into the rooms below. The original video shows him watching through the floor for a total of 30 minutes. Kennedy showed the video to police who questioned the neighbor. He denied the claims, stating that he could only access his neighbor's attic if he used a ladder. With this frightening video as evidence, the man was charged with trespassing, burglary, and stalking. It's truly disturbing to imagine how the situation might have escalated if the video footage hadn't captured these eerie nocturnal activities. If you want more scary videos, then click that link on the top there. Otherwise, there's a playlist there full of all sorts of creepy goodness that'll keep you entertained till our next video. Remember to follow us on our socials as well. We're on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And that's it for me. I'll see you all next time.